Ivy and I'm a little bit of a crazy health nut, but I also love my french fries too. So um, welcome if that's you, you guys, subscribe. I'd love for you to be just a part of my community and I'd love to connect with you. Um, I'd love to answer any questions that you might have on anything, if I can answer it. If I can't answer it, I will find a way. <laughs> I will talk to my mentors and I'll get it answered for you. Today I'm making a beet juice. I'm gonna change it up. It is day eight, I think. I will say, you guys, I mean, if you can't tell by just my face and just like everything, I feel incredible. I feel so good, you guys. I forget how incredible I feel when I just pour juice into my body. Like I just, I forget and then I do it and I just feel amazing. So anyways, it's day eight and today I'm going to make a beet juice. Now, a couple of things I want to say about beet juice before I get into the recipe is that um, one, beet juice is a little harsh on the body. If you guys are just new to juicing, go slow with the beets. Um, two things. One, if you have an ulcer ever at any time or if you're sensitive to ulcers, beets are not good for that. It's going to make you feel really nauseous. So just be mindful of that. Two, if you um, have hormone issues, uh, so if you have uh, maybe not normal periods, if you're uh, in menopause, if you are, um, if you had a miscarriage, if you have uh, not regular periods. Did I already say that? I might have. Um, anyways, anything like that where it's hormonal issues, you guys, uh, beet is a little bit intense. So it pulls toxins into the blood at a really fast rate. So just be mindful of that. They're, they're even better for you if you have those issues, but you're going to want to go slow because you're going to feel a little bit um, nauseous if you're having those issues. So another thing really quick is beet does turn your uh, urine usually bright red. It also turns your stool, number two, uh, bright red. You're not bleeding, I promise. It's just a beet juice. Um, another thing too, if you guys are adding different things into your juices, which I am today, I have been the last couple of days, um, you really want to add it with beet. Beet is a delivery system. Again, it's really rough. So hubby and I are going to actually go to dinner in a little bit. And so I don't know if this is actually the smartest thing to do before we go out to eat, but <laughs> I'm going to get it in because guess what? I committed to 30 days of juice with you. So anyways, like I said, if you haven't already, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and um, I'm, I'm putting uh, recipes up there too, and there's a full community of people, you guys. I'm so excited you don't even know, but okay, let's go ahead and get into the recipe. <laughs> So good. Oh my gosh. Okay. So this is uh, beet, celery, cucumber, kale, um, lots of turmeric. I added some ginger. Um, and then for the herbs, we have turmeric, shishwanda. I can never say that right. Um, reishi mushroom, chlorella. Wheatgrass powder, and I think that's it. Mm. It's so good. You guys, I want to know what you're making. Write in the comments below. I want to know if you're doing this with me. It's hard. Yesterday, I did not want to juice. I did not want to juice. I didn't have the energy to juice. I was tired. Life just got a hold of me, and that's what happens, right? It's so much easier to sit down on the couch with a package of cookies <laughs> or chips or whatever it is and just whatever, like not care, not take care of yourself. But if you do it continuously every single day, you're gonna feel really good. Now, day one, did I feel as good as I did right now? No. You guys, I feel incredible. I feel so good, I feel alive. The weirdest thing about this is, is I am 
Maybe this is TMI, but <laughs> guys, plug your ears, but ladies, this is for you. I am um, actually PMSing right now. I'm supposed to start my cycle um, in like three days. Usually at this time, I feel terrible. I'm moody. I am just cranky. I feel bloated. I feel just like end of the world is happening. <laughs> But no, not right now, I feel incredible. And I think that's just probably the relief from my liver because I've been giving it such good things. So anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow. If you haven't already, subscribe so you don't miss my videos. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.